In this video, we're going to install Visual Studio Code. And to do that, go to code.visualstudio.com and then work your way down to download. And once you're there, select the right version. For us, it's the Mac version with the Apple Silicon. Select that. And the download's been completed. And there it appears in the download folder. All we have to do is drag this to applications, just like that. And it's set up and ready to go. Double click on the Visual Studio code, and we get this message that about whether or not you want to run it. I selected open, and we can see that Visual Studio code is working. Let's stretch this out so we can see the screen. Next, let's go over to extensions on the left and search for Python. And then look for Python with Microsoft. When you select and you enable it, the second one below it also gets implemented, the language support. Now, I've already installed it, so when we click it, we'll see that it's enabled. You can disable it here and re-enable it here if you like. So select enable, and then that's installed, and we'll see that the second one is also installed. Now it's time to open Terminal and to see whether or not Python is connected. The Python we installed in the previous video. And to do that, type in Python 3 dash dash version. And we can see Python 3.13.1 is installed. Let's clean up the screen. And let's open a new file. And let's make it a Python file. Let's save that under Mac Mingle. So now the script file is saved, but it has no content. So let's go ahead and add content. Print, open parens, open quotes, hello world from VS Code, Python, exclamation, close quote, and close the parens. And then we're going to save it as, or let's give it a name that means something. Instead of untitled, we'll call it hello world dot py and it's saved now let's go back to the terminal and type in ls and we can see that the files are right here the hello world is here so it's the original untitled we're going to run the hello world dot py and to do that we type in python 3 space hello world dot pi and the program executes it says hello world from VS Code Python. And well, that's how you run it from the terminal. Now we can also run it directly from VS Code. To do that, let's clear the screen first, then run the dialog, select the Python debugger, and it runs and we see at the bottom in the terminal box there, the hello world. Let's hit that run and debug one more time just to confirm that it's working. There it is, the second time. So we've installed Visual Studio Code. We've connected it to the previous installation of Python, and it's working both in the terminal and in the script mode. In the next video, we'll look at making a small Python application. I hope that helps. Thanks so much for watching.